Good morning, Year 3. It's Mrs. Glocken here. It's Monday morning. Hopefully you've had a nice weekend and you had a good rest and you're ready to complete your lessons for today. If you had a look on the website, you'll see that there are four lessons for today and some really nice new things this week. So we'll start with writing. In writing, we're going to be starting a new text. You're going to meet a um, jungle explorer today in writing and you're going to find out about his adventure. And then your task is to write three things that you would take to the jungle if you could only take three things on an expedition. It's all explained in the slides. It's exciting and it's something new. And we really look forward to seeing your writing today. It will be three really successful sentences. Make sure that make sure that you've got all your punctuation and that they are high five sentences. There's a little sentence um, idea on the slide so you can see what sort of things you're aiming for. Now, reading today is also new. There's um, three, two texts this week and they are 60 second reads. So they're quite short and the idea is you've got to try and read all of the text in 60 seconds. There's a little timer on the slide so you can um, time yourself. Don't worry if you can't, but over the two days that you do the first text, which is called Really Rare Runes, see if you can beat yourself. So if you can read it in, uh, if you can read, I don't know, 40 words on Monday. See if you can read 50 words in 60 seconds on Tuesday. You'll know what I mean when you see the slides and there's some vocabulary work today and then tomorrow you're going to be answering some comprehension questions. Maths this week is also new. We've been um, working on the booklet. We're not working on the booklet anymore. If you want to finish that in your own time, you can do, but we're moving on to an area of maths called statistics. Um, there's videos on the slides. The videos are really important for you to watch and you need to pause them as you go. It tells you to have a little practice of things as you go. There's a little starter with a few questions which you have to look at, pause and then complete in your book and then check the answers. And then there's the main lesson, which is about tally charts today. You'll find out what a tally chart is and how to do a tally. And then there's three questions and a, a challenge question that you will complete. And then when you've done your reading, your writing and your maths, we'd love you to send um, your work to us. There's a fourth lesson because it's Monday and it's science. And it's carrying on our science topic of animals, including humans. And today you're going to find out about animal diets and why certain animals need and eat certain things. There's three types of animal. There's a carnivore, an omnivore and a herbivore. I bet you've heard those words before. I'm not going to tell you what they mean. Your task is to draw a Venn diagram, which is like this. I'm going to show you. I've done one in my book. So it's two circles that overlap in the middle. They're labelled with the three names that I just said and they're big enough for you to draw or write um, the animals that fit into those categories in each section. Now, to draw those circles, I've drawn around one of my little boy's bowls. So I found something round that's about the right size, put it on the page in my book, draw my diagram and then I would complete it with writing in blue writing pen and illustrations, pictures in pencil, just like at school. So there's four lessons today. We can't wait to um, receive your work. Please email us and make sure if you've not already done a reading quiz on your new reading books, then take a quiz. If you haven't been and collected reading books, then you can go onto the Oxford Owl online library, which there are details of on the website, and you can choose a book and read a book on your computer and you can take a quiz that way. So if you um, haven't got reading books, we will be doing another collection very soon. But in the meantime, you can go onto an online library. Have a lovely day. Really look forward to receiving your work. It's really important that you email us every day. It's an expectation that you work at home and you email um, your work to your teachers. So if we don't hear from you, we'll be getting in touch to find out why not. OK, have a lovely day and take care. Enjoy your Monday and we will see you soon. Bye.